The overall goal of this procedure is to micro-inject morpholino oligonucleotides into the cerebral ventricle of the adult zebrafish brain and to knock down the activity of genes in the radial glial cells. This is accomplished by first anesthetizing the zebrafish. Next, a slit is generated in the skull overlaying the optic tectum using a barbed end needle. Then the morpholino solution is injected through the incision site into the cerebroventricular fluid. Finally, the injection efficiency and accuracy are checked under the fluorescence microscope. Ultimately, results can be obtained that show efficient and widespread blockage of protein production from the genes of interest in the radial glial cells of the adult zebrafish brain through morpholino-mediated gene knockdown, which can be assayed by histological sections and immunohistochemical stainings. The main advantage of this technique over the existing methods, like transgenic approaches, or electroporation-based delivery methods is that CVMI is less time-consuming, more efficient in targeting the whole population of radial glial cells, those adjustable, and many genes can be knocked down at the same time. To prepare the injection mixture, begin by making a 500 micromolar morpholino stock solution using PBS. For 10 injections, prepare 10 microliters of injection mix by combining 9 microliters of diluted or undiluted morpholino solution with 1 microliter of a fluorescent tracking dye. Store at room temperature. Use a needle puller to prepare glass injection capillaries according to the following parameters. Turn on the pressure source and adjust the pressure settings to 50 psi or 3.5 bars. Adjust the microinjector settings as follows. Hold pressure 20 psi.